I'm Rachel Moore and right now on your 13 Action News update, the Southern Nevada Health District now issuing a weekly monkeypox update. This comes after U.S. health officials delivered more than 400,000 monkeypox vaccines for health departments nationwide. And this is all ahead of schedule thanks to the federal government's new strategy. It allows providers to give doses that are one fifth of previous doses. To see if you qualify for treatment, visit ktmv.com slash monkeypox. And this morning, a man is recovering after a car hit him last night in North Las Vegas. Police say the man was struck while jaywalking near MLK and Craig. He was rushed to the hospital in critical condition. The driver stayed on scene. And today, downtown Summerlin is holding auditions for two annual parades, the Parade of Mischief during Halloween and their holiday parade later this year. Casting directors are looking for young people at least 10 years old, so come dressed in dance attire and bring a headshot along with the resume. Auditions run from 3 to 5 today through Saturday. It's happening at 450 East Fremont Street. Justin. Give it a couple months. We'll be talking about those Halloween parades out towards Summerlin, holiday parades out there. Uh, we are watching the radar because as we pivot through our Thursday afternoon, scattered thunderstorms are expected. That's not going to be a washout for all Las Vegas Valley neighborhoods, but at least a few of us deal with lightning, downpours, and the potential for some brief gusty wind. Uh, we expect our temperatures uh, to peak in the upper 90s the next several afternoons. Uh, so with these spotty storm chances, we'll try to keep ourselves out of the triple digits. With the humidity, though, still kind of feels pretty warm. 90s through the weekend, Rachel, the storm chance drops off to only 10% Sunday, and we'll catch a couple of completely dry days early next week. Justin, thank you, and that was your 13 Action News update. You can find more on our website at ktmv.com and our free mobile app.